Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how to add another account to Windows 11 that you could use with the email and calendar features that come with Windows. So if you do not know, if you go to calendar, you know, it's a built-in calendar in Windows and it's just the default one that you could use with your uh, logged in account and same with email. You know, you need to set up an account and so on. But let's say you want to add something like your Gmail or Yahoo or Office 365 account to Windows to be used with these apps. It's pretty easy to do. So all you got to do is go to the Settings app. Look for Accounts. Then look for Email and Accounts. And then right here you'll see a section Accounts used by Email, Calendar, and Contacts. So you just want to click on Add Account here. And then choose which one of these options you want to do. You know, you have the Outlook ones, Office 365, Google, Yahoo, even iCloud. And if you want to add like a Pop to your IMAP account separately, you could do that. So we're going to do a Google account for this example. So click on Google. So we're going to put in the email address of this Google account. Okay, and then next. And then the password. So yeah, it recognizes him already with the little, found his uh, picture there. Click on next. And then he just wants to make sure you understand the permissions here, that it's going to read your email from Gmail, check your contacts and calendar, and you just click on allow. And then it wants to know what you want to use for your name when you send messages. We'll just use Todd. Click on sign in. Okay, so that's all done. So now if we close this out and we go back to the email app, see, we could see that we have all Todd's Gmail stuff here with his account and all his emails there. And if we go to the calendar, we could see we have his calendar as well. So here's the Gmail calendar. Here's the default calendar. You could turn that off if you don't want to see that. You can change the colors and so on. So here's the Todd calendars. You could turn off this one if you just want to get rid of all the other nonsense, like the you know if you want, don't want to see holidays, you could turn off that and so on. So now we have just Todd's calendar here in the red, and like you could see if we turn, you could see the color matches. So if you turn that off, it doesn't show his stuff. So that, you know that shows that his calendar is working. And then if we go to contacts, we could see we have Todd's contacts there as well. So those imported as well. So pretty simple. So once again. Just go to Start, Settings, Accounts, Email and Accounts, and then Add a New Account. And you can see we have this one here now. And if you click down here, you can manage it, change the settings, and also delete it if you change your mind. So pretty simple. So give it a shot, add your own accounts, and you'll be good to go. All right, thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe.